Large sections of ocean off the Northern Territory are among a host of new marine reserves announced today, which will stretch over a third of Australia's coastline. The federal government says it makes Australia a world leader in protecting sea life, but the Territory's commercial fishermen say it's a disaster. In less than six hours, thousands of square kilometres of top-end waters will become marine national parks. But don't be alarmed, our fishing lifestyle won't be compromised. We put them in areas where by and large we are not talking about a significant impact to recreational fishing at all. The federal government has created these new reserves not only here in the Territory but across Australia to protect marine life and oceans. It contains more acid, it contains much more plastic and it contains less life. And our oceans are under serious threat. Around Australia, there will be dozens of national marine parks in total, more than 2.3 square kilometres of ocean set aside. But for anti-commercial fishermen, it's another blow to their industry. There's about 220 licences in the Northern Territory and one way or another they're all affected. Any loss of ground or area without any compensation or, or minimal compensation um, just devalues their businesses. The federal government has put aside $100 million to compensate the industry. I doubt that $100 million uh, is going to be enough money to compensate the commercial sector uh, for the losses they'll incur. It's not just the industry that will be affected. Territory families will be slugged when the price of seafood goes up. It'll either be increases of Australian fish or you'll be eating more and more imported fish. We're already up to about 85%. But the federal government says at least we're protecting our precious seas and leading the way globally, sending a strong message to the rest of the world. Christina Castales, Nine News.